lot of times, no doc. There he is, Sam, vampire. <laughs> <laughs> <Stay there. laughs> <laughs> All right, guys, so here's the load. Uh, you got some stuff falling over back there still. Yeah, I've seen it. <sighs> but, give y'all a quick sneak peek, because when this stuff comes off the trailer, here, hold the camera. When this stuff comes off the trailer, it's still blank. Bringing color to life. You got a whole bunch of little girl makeup thing with the okay, lights inside okay, the stand. Okay, that looks like a half okay so today's going to be a good, busy day. Half palette, and then down here we got... Uh, today's going to be a very good, busy day, y'all. There's the LOLs, 12 packs or 18 packs of LOLs. Uh, everybody does really good with those. Mm-hmm. Here's the scooters. Hopefully we have enough got, of those. To... Oh, I know. I got y'all in 3D. There go the scooters. Okay, we're going to see what's in the box under the scooter. Ooh, Fortnite. 45 caliber. Ooh. <laughs> we got that Fortnite, Good morning, bro. Saran and Selena. <laughs> look at that, y'all. Fortnite is at retail regulator. Does it look like a 45 auto? Oh, nice. Looks Very good. Nice. <laughs> looks like the Lord Croc gun. Hey, say hello to the world, JJ. Hello, world. <laughs> <laughs> looks like we got a half pallet of those. That'll uh, work. This is the uh, full size memory foam down alternative mattress pad. All right. Another 12 pack over here. That's probably more LOLs, which is a great thing. Yep. Because that buys the whole pallet. Yep. There Throw it is. One of those on there. It buys the whole damn pallet. There it is. That's going to be. Laundry box. basket hampers. Oh, yeah. Oh, yes. Three pack. Ooh, we got the good ones. Oh. Those are the forty forty three dollars uh, a four pack. Those are the actual dolls. Those are the LOLs again. Whoa. Those are more of those for sure. Okay, so Looks we like got a half a pallet of those new LOLs. Here's another pallet of LOLs to here. It looks like. <laughs> uh, we LOL'd out. Makeup. A lot of LOLs and makeup. Huh. Another four pack of scooters. That's a makeup. That's the uh, makeup, right? Yeah. Yeah, that's the makeup girl. Makeup. The makeup Another girl. Another four pack of scooters. Girl. Man, I'm thinking about seriously parking my Buick, man, and scooting on the work more, back from one of these More the expensive dolls, dude. More Look at that, y'all. $40 a pack in there, ladies. Look $40 a pack there, Look at that. There, Look at that. Ooh, let me put my... Thank you, Sharon Nestle. She said, you guys stay, have fun doing boxes and breaking down. Stay cool. More FOMO machines. Well, there's one FOMO machine. But this can't be a FOMO. Size. Well, y'all, it's going to be 100 degrees out here again today. I think we sold out of these the first time we got them. This is the uh, seesaw or the seagrass baskets. Definitely mm -hmm. sold out of those. Those were amazing. Mm -hmm. All the way to there. And then tables. Tables on the bottom. Everybody loved the tables, too. Oh, yeah. We got a lot of more. The tables kicked butt. Uh, this is the super nice blankets. Home goods. Um Uh, super nice three-tier room. Uh, room essential. Oh, that's nice. That's super nice. Three-tier on wheels. Uh, um, all the way to there, and then tables on the bottom. I switched back and missed some stuff. I think. No, I didn't. No, I didn't. No, I didn't. We're good. We're good. All right. Uh, Matt, ha Matt Hamburger 
The electric scooter's a bomb. My 16-year-old loves it. Mine too. Huh, there it is, y'all. Right, seagrass baskets. So this is two pallets of seagrass baskets and two pallets of tables. I am. This is a third I pallet did. of seagrass baskets and tables. And this is why it's changing up, y'all. Is that true your stomach growl? My stomach. Good Lord. You smell like food. Uh, you FOMO ain't... machines. So the FOMO machines will be back on the pallets. Oh, oh Lord. Sheesh. Room essentials all the way down. So we got four of these plus the tables. That's going to be a lot of those, bro. It looks like the whole freaking thing is those. All the way. The whole bottom? <laughs> the whole bottom. It might be the whole rest of the truck because everything, if you see the way it's stacked, it's stacked on tables and then it's stacked on tables with the uh, with the three-tier uh, table. It's a bitchin' table and I'm sure we can sell 50. Happy oh, birthday, Tony they're, Buckley. They're going to have to go on pallets. You She's know a I mean? young but it's a bitchin' item. Three. They look killer. Everybody say happy birthday to Tony Buckley. Happy birthday, Tony. And I can't get in there no farther. She's a, she's a young happy birthday tony not happy birthday bony she's a young 63 today Ow. enjoy your day and we hope Ooh, many more to come nerves? i still have a nerve for bro hi margo i'll be direct margo follow i know thank you no way we open straight up and down, so you got to hold the straight up and down now. Hey, I'm going to mic Ted up, Jason. All right. I don't want to be mic'd up unloading the truck. I was tired of eating it. Every time I turn it around, my beer was in my mouth. I wake up, it's all up in there. I'm like, uh, hey, you should have uh. just put three in here. We could have called you Dub C the second. I don't know what that means. How many of the scooters did we get? This truck doesn't look as bad as the, the, the truck yesterday. Oh, you didn't know that? Yeah. J A Y S U N. Those are nice. It's because he's my lady. I knew it. He's my lady. He's my lady. Ooh, we got some wolves. So, Ted, you guys are ready for that two I'm really stoked to eat testicles. That possum butt is good. That was possum butt now. All right, yeah. I'll try anything twice. I don't know if anything you do will be as bad as the uh, the petrified deck nuck that Jason ate a couple months back. Did you say petrified deck? Deck. Duck neck. Duck neck. I can't speak today. I'm just jumbling my words. Maybe I'm going to have an aneurysm. Who knows? You got your beard tied up too tight. You know, my beard's tied up too tight. Uh, are these the same ones we have? The E300s? Is it really like a big old wheelie bar on the back? Wow, just in case you want to feel a little squirrely and yeah, do some lilies. Why not? Save you gas money. Uh, that's never gonna happen, bro. Never gonna happen. Hey! Uh, Nathan has a scooter, right? Yeah. Is that really wheelie bar on the back really work? Oh yeah. Yeah? I've never ridden it. Really? Down mattress hey, pad. You lining me up? Yeah. I'm lining you up. You smell funny, Sam. Ooh. You smell like hey, bacon. hey, 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 relax. Don't get hungry. Uh, the only thing you missed over there is another pallet of LOLs. My woman didn't There's a pallet one. of uh, comforters. I was trying to get on that, too. You're good. And that's yeah. all I think you didn't see so Ice far. That, that's the three the three tier orange. Uh, I went to the store last night and I got everything to make them, but she just didn't make me one. 
That's okay. She had a long day yesterday. You know, the kids went to school, so she was home alone. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. I had a lot of work. I had a lot of work around. Yeah. Decent amount of lulls. Yeah. Hey, they're the expensive ones, too. Ooh, good luck with that one back there. What's that? More housewares? Well, I don't know what Tops housewares, that. bottoms mm. LOL dolls. No bueno. I'm guessing the truck driver drove like a turd. You can tell when they're hitting the corners real fast when the ones in the front of the trailer are, are messed up. That's when it's the driver. Mm -hmm. That's when it's the driver. When it's the ones in the back, it's, yeah. 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 JJ. Yeah. JJ. Little dance. Little dance. So how many items do we have to try tonight? How many irons? How many items? Oh, items like seven. We got like six and a tiebreaker. A tiebreaker. Tie so whoever wins wins. Like whoever yeah, guesses right the most. Seat. If you Ow. take it and put it in your mouth and hold it for three seconds, that's a point. If you spit it out, that's okay. If you throw up, that's minus a couple points. If you swallow it, that's plus a couple points. Okay. And then we'll get the fans to root for their favorites. We'll do the point system. Bruce is supposed to come in to write down points. Vicky's Bruce can write? Yeah, Vicky's going to show the audience what the items, what the items actually are with you guys. I've got them all written down and everything. All right. So they can see... And you guys have black ones, you had six different silky ones to choose from. Ooh. I got them from the adult store. I hope so. Nice, nice. So they're new, they don't smell like I like that. Well, uh, I have I have the weakest gag reflex ever, so I might chuck, we're gonna need some when buckets. You and Jason do it your own time, it's your own business. I know, I know, but. There were a lot of great suggestions from all over the world. How hard was it to find the stuff? Was it pretty easy to find the stuff? Uh, no, some of it was hard. Really? Some of it took me a couple weeks. Some things took me a week to prepare. Really? But uh, some of them were just too cost preventative and too uh, time preventative. Gotcha. So, sorry, I can't do that. Uh, yes, sir. Wow, what do you want, water? I'll make sure there's no allergies beforehand and everything there I need. Oh, I'm allergic to that. You're allergic to what? Licorice? I'm allergic to that. For sure. Watch this. Hey! Fire in the hole! Ow. Nice catch! I knew Sam was a catcher. He told me he was a pitcher. Really? He lied to you. He's just multifaceted. Ooh, what you said? Multifaceted. Yes, sir. Wow. Wow. Hey, that's the new Hulu. Guys, while they're removing some of this stuff, let me go around the line here. Pallet of salt. <laughs> that came in on a truck yesterday, I believe. Turbo loads. Here's some of Jason's Home Depot stuff that came in yesterday. We showed on the video already. Some of it will be sold straight out as pallets. Others will be dumped into the bin sales for Saturday's fresh bin sale. More scooters on the top of this one. Case packs of it looks like some toys or housewares on the bottom.
What's on the bottom? Did you guys crack them already? LOL. The, uh, LOL on the bottom. The $42, uh, 42 bucks buy. That's an expensive pallet. Very nice. Case packs here, $42. It sounds like a pack. The cases have three of the individual items in it, I guess, at $42 an item. Makes for a very expensive pallet there. That one's a case pack of 12 from Target. Could be some of those uh, Nerf guns. That one says clothes written on it, but you just never know. Here it comes with another one. Little kids' wooden tables. What's on top? More blankets and stuff? Uh, that top one's a FOMO machine. FOMO up top. The bottom is a seagrass basket. Sam! Sam! That's it. Oh, here we go. 50 by 60. Looks like there's some type of blankets. Comforters, maybe. Picture of origin, blah, blah, blah. Color gray, 50 by 60s. We'll pop them open here in a couple and see exactly what it is. And it'll take a cut in a minute here when it'll take the rest of the truck over to the storage units next door. Here's the bin sale going on. Today is $2 day. So people were waiting at the doors before it opened this morning coming in here to pick their items that were left from the Home Depot and Amazon and it's two dollars an item a day drop that grab a pallet real quick oh never mind I got it My winky, Give me my one winky. row of these on that. Hey, Ted, if you got um, Elizabeth Martins or Beth Martins, I told her I'd knock her box out this morning. Her box was knocked out by Kathy. What? He Kathy said Kathy already knocked the box. Oh, her labels are on the refrigerator. She repeated them on accident. Oh, so it's already done? You sure? Yeah, because the day Kathy built her box, uh, I went in and put it off those ships. I wouldn't have reprinted them. Here's a look at you need to ask her if she bought two, because I, I think she got a Kathy and a personal shopper. Oh, they both did? Okay, Beth, if you're watching this, both of yours have already been done and mailed out, so... Uh, so why is there still shit on the refrigerator? So give us a heads up. You know, would you say seven to ten days before they'll get there? Yeah, right around. Yeah, right, by that time, there'll be the other merchandise row? in here. Sorry for... You know, going back and forth, but the two are already done ASAP and sent out to you. Yeah, you need a couple of those? Here, we'll grab a couple of those, too. The only person, if Nancy Nipper is watching, I need a list from you. I haven't gotten a list from you. Nancy Nipper? Nipper. Nipper. If you're watching, Ted needs a list from you. Here, of try your and top put three of those on there. In order of priority of what you want, and then the rest of the box will be filled with et cetera stuff. Decent stuff, good stuff, <laughs> but just filler stuff. But make sure you put it in the priority you want it, because if the box starts getting full, if you got your favorite item is number 10, it's not going to squeeze in there. Does that look like a half pallet to you? Just about, about another row. Do they get an email confirmation or uh, yeah, from the company? The oh, okay. Yeah, so you guys right. check your email confirmations of your boxes with tracking numbers. I was trying to keep it easy because I don't think he's going to be able to get all that in his truck. But, uh. <laughs> okay. While they're getting this stuff together. Let me give you a quick walkthrough. I don't know if anybody's taking you in the back room lately. 
These things are really cool. 54-inch acrylic portable basketball hoops. First, I thought it was the wooden gate doors here, but nah. It's here where the man is shooting the basketball. Acrylic hoop with the stand. <laughs> no, no, people, I'm sorry that won't fit in a personal shop. <laughs> Still got a couple of the pergolas, I guess you call it. The arches. The arched entryways are arched Hamilton Bay. Hampton Bay. Here we go. There's a picture of it. You still got a few of those left. He got a bunch of these easy ups, instant shades like he was talking about in. So if you could use one of those, great prices on those. Here we go. Mirrors, clocks. Big old curl bar. I don't know how, how we'd mail that out, but if you want to come in the shop, here, will probably make you a great deal on it. Some student chairs, like a little flip up writing area on it. Some vanities. Do, 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 do. Uh, something. I guess it's advertising that chair. I'm going to try to step in here so the light comes on, so excuse me just a second. The view goes all winky. Okay, more vanities. More rollaways. Right, so more vanities. Uh, do, 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 do. Nice, big, double one out here. He's got these really nice rollaways that come in with like the butcher block work station, work surface on them. Couple of them even roll up and down. Okay, here you go. Oops, that one's got a crack in it. Got a nice smoker back here, one of those pellet smokers. A couple of these like white velvet or velour couches. Chairs, patio sets. This is another workstation table. Like, I don't know where you could put it, a banquet table or out in the garage, because it's got that same like dark wood as a work surface on the top of it. To do a stove, more. There's a nice roll away. That one's got that lift top, the bottom one, the black one. That wood part of it lifts up so you can hide tools and stuff underneath there. More tables and chairs. Another vanity. Okay, go in another room. Like a shadow box down here on the bottom. Uh, people that sell craft shows and such would be a great glass top display box. Vanity. Medicine ball, little artificial trees or bushes, chandelier, skateboards. That is that cold, uh, it's like a, like a dehydrator, but it's a cold smoker, cold something or other. I forgot the exact terminology of it. I think Ted's talked about ready, it Ready, ready? Yeah, yeah. All right. Very nice, very expensive. You just follow me in the white sure truck. We're here about half price. And he's got a bunch of these outside heaters. Yeah. I know it's a little warm now. But uh, those things are great. We got a couple of them for last winter. Put them out there in that top shield. You can aim it in different directions and it would direct the heat different ways for you. Nice edger here, nice DeWalt edger. Nice little roll away. You can have wheels on the bottom, I think. A little stand, a little feet. Still have some of the fingerprint safes over there in the corner. A hair dryer, a couple blue velour chairs, a golf trolley, trolley I guess is what you call it, that you put your bag onto. How much is the range? I'll find out for you. Hold on. Let's see. The range is $799, so $800, so at Home Depot it must have been $1,600. Hold on just a second, I'll get you. It's an LG. Here's the thing to scan it, and there's the model number. Oops. There's the model number, if that helps out in your thin queue. Yes, range, brand new. They took it out of the box. That and that side-by-side side stainless refrigerator freezer, that thing sold almost immediately. Now, I know there's going to be a lot of people who fish watching this. That aluminum thing down there is a fishing cart. It's got the pole holders all around it. You put your ice chest in the center of it. It's got the little handle. And a little thing there for umbrella or whatever you want to stick in there. I would have bought that immediately, but I already have one at home. They're great for putting your stuff in and taking it out to the lake, real lightweight. Haul all your stuff, put your chairs on top of it or whatever. Exercise bench. Some little cubbies for the house. Some fold-up chairs. Dog beds. They still have a good quantity of dog beds. These chairs, which are groovy, baby. They're like the velour 
kind of retro look. You raise them up and down, bar stool, chair type deals. Luggage, he's got suitcases back here. He's got the stands. If you guys didn't see it yesterday, and unless I'm misquoting, if he took them out to the auction, I don't know. But he has a whole pallet of Christmas trees. I think the ones with the built-in lights, the artificial trees. So, very nice. Do -do -do, a lot of pillows. A little like a wicker. A woven outside, uh, inside, outside, wherever you want to use it. It's yours once you own it. Couch dealy. All right, that's all for back here. Let's get back to our show in progress. See what these guys are doing building these new pallets. All right, here we go. Up on the top there, you can see the toy pallets that are already made. And I'd say probably 90% of those or more are already sold. So if you're a pallet buyer and you're looking for toys, you're going to have to hit them up for some of these new ones they're making down here. Or you may have a few of those left over in the other storage units next door. But uh, people are buying the pallets. One guy, I guess Monday, bought 24 pallets. So those things are flying out of here for resale, for transporting down to our southern border and going across. I guess they sell really well down there. There's Vicky. Hi, Vicky. Good morning. Did they take off? <laughs> All right. Uh, before I end this thing, I'm going to give you a quick walk through of the shop real quick. Jason, the truck took off. Ted's over here mailing out some more boxes that are going out. And here we go. So it has one of these doors here, $99. The one behind it, I can't get you a good view of, but it's that Spanish-style mahogany door, the one behind this one. Very nice. It's got the little like visual port where you can open it and look out like a peephole, but probably about a six by six, so you can get a good view of people. Let me do the stuff behind the counter real yep. quick, hun, so they don't get to see this that often. Okay, the Milwaukee tools up here. Some may have a price on them, but they're not for sale. They are for gifts for people that are gonna be winning the subscriber page, the subscriber drawing on the 15th. So keep in mind, if you're a winner, They'll give you another view of this, but choose from something up there, something down, well, I don't know about the lights, those are too big to ship, but something up there for your Milwaukee gifts, or, you know, you could probably even talk him into a Batman collector set or whatever. He'll give you an idea of what's your choice. The stuff on the second and third shelves are for sale, and on the bottom if you see anything down there. So some of these things, um, depending what they are and how well they can travel and that kind of stuff. Some may be included in personal shopper boxes if you were to ask. Some may not. So don't don't quote me as saying JJ said I can get a hundred of those things in my personal shopper box because that's not going to happen. <laughs> he hooks you up right. He gives you more than your value. They give you more than your value. But uh, he can't give you like two thousand dollars worth of merchandise for one hundred and fifty nine dollars. Uh, doormats. These things. Funny situation. I wrote that little sign down there that keeps getting moved down. Eight dollars for a doormat. These things were about twice that high when they first came in. I shuffled them around because that's where I sit most of the day, on these comfortable doormats that will support me. Each day I come in, my seat is lower and lower and lower because these things are selling like crazy. All right, we got some toys up here. WandaVision, those blockbuster games, the FOMO, some of these little guys over here, the junky things they call them, some more Barbies, some more water balloons. They got the Kramer down there, one of the, what do you call them, the pop, pop, uh, something or other. I collect those damn things, I don't even know what they're called, the pops. Okay, mini toys you saw. Do, 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 excuse my humming. Food grade earth something or other. Fresh water, yada, yada, food grade, compost, blah, blah, blah. Okay. Block train for little ones. He's got some Christmas stuff up here. Like I said, those trees just came in. Some lights. Some of uh, the poinsettias, the imitation ones. Disposable under pads. These things are neat, these wooden deals here. I threw a couple of those in the personal shopper boxes. They're heavy duty, like, I don't want to call them ironwood, but really sturdy wood. You can put utensils or anything you want to. My wife does a lot of scrapbooking, so I'll put her scrapbook stuff in there. Dog trimmers, dog nail trimmers. Some bowls, like porcelain, ceramic type bowls. 
Uh, some more of the makeup stuffs over there. Bedding down below, bedding down below. Uh, some of the little bags that came in. The little thing in the middle of the tan stuff, a couple of backpacks I put in people's personal shopper boxes. And Health Expert Electronic Stimulator for your fetuses. A couple of jackets, some more comforters, electronic muscle stimulator, jackets, housewares down here. They've got uh, picture frames and little things to hold candles and microfiber sheets. These things are cool. We've got one to put the counter here now. You can put your knickknacks in there, hold pens in there, hold drinks in there, paper clips, whatever. Doesn't have to be a desk unit. You've got some shoes down at the bottom. Some, whoops, I almost lost his phone. I never heard the end of that. Some uh, blankets and stuff. These things are cool. It's these little um, kid towel wrap deals. We put a couple of those in the personal shopper boxes that had children. Uh, they go up in a little bag there, and when you unfold them, it's got a hood, and it's made out of soft, like, I don't call it terry cloth, maybe microfiber, like a towel for drying and stuff when they get out of the pool or get out of the bathtub. Sandals. Some of these uh, blackout room darkening. Just not blackout, the room darkening drape type deals. Some of those went in personal shopper boxes. We got some kitchen towels down below. Some canisters, purses, bags, little pink cases. Looks like there's only maybe three of those, three or four of those blue drinking cups left there, the tall ones. They got a, some of the wine ones still left, some little crocs. Some of the lids with straws that go onto different type of drinking cups. So those things are very nice. Baggies down there, some housewares up here, and be cautious if you get some of this glass stuff, we'll wrap it as best possible for those boxes, but be very careful with that stuff. All right, some little top uh, lid coffee mug deals, moisture absorbent stuff. Now, the TV's not for sale. Uh, once upon a time, he did have flat screens for sale in here. That one's for their personal viewing pleasure. And they put some of the retail regulator YouTube videos. If you haven't tuned into YouTube, he also has a YouTube page. And Seth, his son, is listing a whole bunch of stuff on there, like the old videos and redoing the videos and reposting uh, new videos from Facebook onto YouTube. So check out the YouTube channel. It's a zero subscriber, free subscriber and following type deal. And um, he's talked about doing prizes on that one but I don't think he ever got enough uh, full-time subscribers to make the prizes happen. He'd have to give you that information himself. Still some of the soap, even though we keep filling that thing up, it keeps going down. People love that stuff. The little hand sanitizer type deals. Some of these sets. The blue set here with your bowls, your little salad plates and your regular plates. Uh, $20 for a set of those. These are the boxes they come in. Those little bowls there, I got them for cereal and stuff at home. Uh, three for a dollar on those things. So if you get a box and you want some of those, just tell me and I will load it up with those. Those little resealable deals are neat. You open them up and there's a little plastic food, fork and spoon in the top of them. There's a little area for dip in the top of them, like salad dip or dressing or whatever. There's a top layer where you can put stuff you don't want to get mixed in with stuff that goes on your bottom layer. So very nice. Some kind of little kid uh, splash thing up there. Coming down, coming down, a pool float here. Uh, imitation little plants here. Little bitty, I don't know, use them for utensils, use them for whatever you want. We still have a few of the 20 piece silverware sets. So I put a couple of those in different personal shopper boxes. You can always get two or three of those in your box. Uh, folding chairs, won't fit in the box obviously. These suitcases, word to the wise, that box that I overstuffed. Um, you can get one of those suitcases, we'll open it up and cram pack it full of stuff, but you can't really get two in one personal shopper box. It overfills it. Also the Batman Collector's Edition thing up there, that big expensive one, you can get one of those in your personal shopper box, but the rest of it's going to be filled with all kinds of really small, small things because it takes up most of the box. Batman sets up there, basketball sets, Uno Play, Halo. Uh, looks like, is it Nat? Na 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 dolls? Hmm, na 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 dolls. Uh, rainbow kitchen type deals, little dolls. 
Ah, their kitchen stuff. Mermaids they still have. Little kids' basketball courts. Roblox they've got. Uh, queen size. Looks like an inflatable mattress. All right, going around here. Here's some of the other suitcases. I put one of the dinosaurs in a box. One of the, uh, like the home. It's not a Homer Simpson, but it's a donut one. We always call it the Homer Simpson deal. They still have the little uh, leopard pink suitcases. The weighted blankets. I think they're 12 pounds or more a piece. Some curly cuts, a little thing where you can groom your little fake doggy. Now I have no sound. Oh, sorry, people. Do the rest of you have any sound or did I lose you? What is a personal shopper box? There's two different types. There's one that Kathy does, Kathy Bowden. When she'll walk around one-on-one -on -one with you, you pick the items and you pay that price for the items. She puts them in your box to be mailed out to you. She charges you the price of the sale for all the items. And then she charges you uh, shipping because she's got to ship them to you. And she charges you a handling fee because she's got to do the work of loading it. Uh, the other type of personal shopper box, since I'm here and I don't work for Jason, I just hang out while my wife is here two days a week working for his wife at the register. I get the list of personal shopper items. You pay $159 for your box shipped out to you. You can pick 10 items in the priority of what you want. Number one choice all the way down. They've got to reasonably be able to fit into the box. You know, like I said before, no lawn chairs and stuff like that because they wouldn't fit into a box. Then whatever room we have left, we pack them with oven mitts, with utensils, with small toys, if that's what you want. If some of your list had other items of toys for boys and girls, we'll match whatever it is and put more stuff in there. We'll put some small electronics if we got them on hand. We'll, uh, we'll do all we can do to fill that box. You can talk to some of the people that should be getting some of their first boxes or have already gotten them that I filled, and they can let you know they were cram-packed. There was probably three or $400 worth of merchandise in a $159 box straight to your house. Uh, the FOMO's up there, too big to go in a personal shopper box. More toys up on the top, and there's those Batman collector deals. There's a neat looking gun, folds up in a little suitcase. Some kind of boneless race car set deal. It looks like a dinosaur deal. It's got a fence around it, it's got little, let me get closer. Huh, I don't know. I was gonna say it's got little dinosaurs. Maybe you can make them out, I don't see the little dinosaurs there. Yeah, they charge tax now. I'm sorry. Thanks, Ellen. So don't forget, you're going to have to do the tax on the personal shopper boxes and on the Kathy boxes. Anything that goes through online or goes through, I don't want to say it straight out. Anything that goes through online, they've got to charge tax on it because there is tracking and accountability on that stuff. Those of you that have dealt with the auctions before, you know how that goes. They have a couple different categories, whether you're paying cash or whether you're paying credit card. So... Um, more dinosaur stuff there. I put a lot of these little sipper cups. They're the regular Contigo, like the big blue chiller cups over there. Uh, they're for little kids, I think for whoever you want. If you only want a small drink, they'll work just as well. These things are called party pitchers. They're like little chillers. I guess you could put a pitcher of lemonade, pitcher of mojito, pitcher of margarita, whatever you would like in there. Cocoa melons, still a big variety of cocoa melons. As you can see, they're getting picked from on the shelf, but there's several different kinds. Way up top there, there's some more of those eggs. The LOL eggs. There's those hover deals. Those things are fun. Got one of those at home. Charges up USB within maybe 10 to 15 minutes. Lasts for about 10 minutes. Hovers all around the house, flashing lights. When it comes by you, it's got little sensors, so uh, usually it doesn't run into fans and ceilings and stuff. Mine has. But usually, no, it avoids it because of little sensors on it. And when it gets near you, you can sit it in a different direction by your different hand gestures. There's some more of them. Sea turtles. Some more dinosaurs. There's that gun again I was telling you about. Looks like a little beach set for clothing for dollies. Disney set down at the bottom with Minnie Mouse in a car. Pixar. The remix of the little alien guys. Do to do Roblox adopt me bees. That's funny. Nerf gun. 
Baby shark, shark, shark. Little fluffies. Houseware stuff on the bottom. Looks like brushes and stuff. They still have some of the tea fall sets and things. If you want one of those, some of those fit in the personal shopper boxes. We crammed some water balloons. Anybody that had any kind of children that they were shopping for in a pers personal shopper box, we crammed these water balloons in them because they don't take much room at all. Any of the messages I'm getting, if it pertains to the shop here, make sure you um, do a direct message to Ted Ryan because sometimes they don't go back and read all the comments on these feeds if they're busy. So I'll try to read what I can and try to forward him what I can. But if you need an answer like my box didn't go out yet or did it go out, can I put this or that in it, hit them up and hit them up ASAP. So he's, but he's boxing up stuff right now. I won't be down that way until probably 8 p.m. They'll be here tomorrow. They open up at 9, so they'll be looking forward to seeing your smiling face. You'll enjoy this place. Like I said, I've known him as friend of the family for two years now. I've been in this shop and his storage wars units next door when he did those sales uh, 18 months ago. Anyway, for two years now, I've come to this shop once a week, every week, religiously, and sometimes more often. And I live about 17 miles away. So it is very addicting. It is very fun. These guys are better than watching TV at home. They keep me cracking up all day. Ryan's World, little figures. Rain, the final battle royale. Monster, looks like some kind of car wash or something. You put your little trucks through. More toys, more toys, and more toys. Fast and Furious cars, those will fit in the box. Little doggies. I took my grandkids a couple few of these different type home. They're very nice. They're squishy. They easily fit into your box, in the personal shopper box. Color changing surprise, LOLs. Oh, that's cool. I haven't even seen this. It's an RC wakeboard boat. It must have just come in on the last target load earlier this week or Saturday or something. Batman Street Justice. Big box of the Crayola sidewalk chalk. Also, they have smaller boxes. Sometimes a big box, if you want one, that takes up a big chunk of your personal shopper box. But the littler boxes, I'll show you here in a minute. We can get a couple of those in if you wanted it. Different kind of decorations, different kind of dinosaurs. Dog food. If you want some of this, you can always hit them up. Maybe we can put some of that in a personal shopper box. If you got a pet at home, they'd appreciate that, I'm sure. These things are kind of cool. They're expandable little handle magnets. So if you have a shop, have a garage, you just have stuff you drop on the floor like me and have a hard time picking up, grab one of these and keep it at home. And if it's metal that can be picked up by a magnet, you can use those puppies to pick it up. Tonka toys up top there. A couple of those are not personal shopper boxes. Uh, unfortunately, this big Toshiba air fryer will not go out in a, in a personal box. Put out a couple of these little pony guys in there. Little tent thing for kids to play in with a light inside. That's cool. Milwaukee pack out, just the case. Like I said, Milwaukee tools are behind the counter. They're for prizes on the subscriber page, on the subscriber winners. Like you know before, if you haven't been a subscriber, please subscribe. $4.99 a month. If you have been a subscriber, some of you might chime in on your choices, what you've won. And on the 15th is when he goes home with his son Seth. They do the wheel unless there's some kind of urgency, emergency. Something can't happen. Then they'll do it ASAP a day or two later. But generally, no problem. It's done on the 15th. Each month group. I think, Sharan, you can back me up, you and... Uh, Selena, I think they're up to like nine months now. So if you've been a subscriber for nine months, you're in one group. Eight months, you're in one group. Seven, all the way down to finishing your one month subscriber, then you're in the one month group. And they can also tell you, I don't think, I don't know, you can ask them, Selena and uh, Saran. Ask them, I don't think if you first subscribe, I don't know if you qualify to be a one month subscriber until you've been a subscriber for the for one month then you qualify. And each group in the order of uh, nine all the way down to one, they get to choose something of their liking behind his counter there of the stuff he'll represent as uh, gifts for subscribers. And then like he's told all of us, at the end of your 12 months continual subscription, 
he'll give each person a $200 uh, gift of some type. More Nerf guns. Learn and play. These are cool. They're like a little kid's kind of a laptop activity suitcase deal. They can open it up and if you see this thing, look it up online and it'll tell you everything it does. Little kid's pottery wheels. Uh, some little, I call them like micro machines. Pocket series. A little like a fire truck, police car. It's got all the little street signs. Still have some of the Batman. Batman, Batman, different Batman. Superman, Superman, Superman. I think Cyborg is all gone. More of these. Looks like some type of little soccer ball or such. More figures. Can't get that big truck toolbox into a personal shopper box. Sorry. Uh, I don't know what those little things are down there. Something new. Another Batman action figure. I think that's one that his bat wings extend out to the side. Little kids like a dresser, bathroom set, vanity set. Another Batman set with looks like Batman and three additional characters and a motorcycle. Barbie set. Different types of Nerf guns. You could theoretically get a personal shopper box with nothing but Nerf guns. Have a huge Nerf gun party at your house. Bathtub toys for Coco Melon. Razors won't fit inside a personal shopper box. Here he is. Okay, Jason's calls for his phone, so I'm coming back to him. I'm walking, I'm walking, I'm walking. Don't forget any of your questions. Forward them to the guys directly. I'll try to read the feed afterwards. It's still live if you want to end it up. I'm just doing a walkthrough. Why, thank you. Jason, they had a question. You pay your fee your first month. Do you qualify or not until you've been a subscriber for one month? No, you're in the month. You're, you're in the month category. Okay, then there you go, people. That answers your question. How that works is it, it basically. Uh, okay, Jim. Yeah. Bag of you're in you're in month one all through from zero to one month and one month to two months you're still in one month and then as soon as you hit two months you've got two months status right on tabitha appreciate you guys uh i gotta get back to the uh warehouse the other side now because i gotta finish unloading pallets and i need my phone so thank you guys for watching what up joe we will return thank y'all for watching